Hello brew tubers. This has been uh, a long time coming this video. I haven't taken for a while this. Is Abernethy Brothers Brewing Brew Shed. Um, we're just uh, getting to a stage where we think we can see the end. Hey, brew tubers, brew fans. Uh, we are Abernathy Brothers Brewing. Uh, I'm Daniel. I'm Simon. And uh, that sounds a bit gay. <laughs> <laughs> um, welcome, this is our brew channel. Um, we'll be doing a range of videos on uh, YouTube. Uh, we'll do uh, brew house build first. Brew house build, of course, that's where we're at the moment. Um, that it will have uh, several uh, clips on our brew house. Uh, we'll do uh, grain of glass. Uh, we'll do some reviews, um, basically of anything that we're using. Really, uh, we we like to tinker. Um, hence the brew house. Um, at the moment, we're brewing in the uh, area what do we two. Call it? Area two. It's the uh, test brew facility uh, at my place. Uh, we're brewing on a brew father system there. Um, we'll take brew some father. shots there. Uh, what did I say? Brew father. Brew father. <laughs> uh, it's a grain father system. We do use brew father software. Um, we've been brewing for how many years now? Four. I'd say four years. No, it'd have to be more than that. We've been building this bloody thing for almost that time. Maybe five. Five? Maybe even a bit longer. We can't remember. Uh, we started yeah. off uh, doing some extract brewing at the Brew It Your Own. Brew Your Own. Brew Your Own. Factory. Mass produced stuff. It was fun to start with. Didn't really like it. Um, it was a bit funky. Yeah, the sanitary practices are somewhat to be desired. Yeah. So uh, I went and invested in the grain father. <coughs> Great little system. Mm. Uh, churned out some cracking beers. Um, but uh, this is the main brew house. Uh, it's been so long in the making. All right, chunks. Talk me through it. Yes, you folks. <laughs> You're an idiot. Yes, we've uh, just got the floor down. Uh, floor. On Friday. Uh, drain. We've got a little bit of ceiling to do around here. Yeah. Um, yeah. The last, the, the wires are going in. Right. The control wires for air hang on, conditioning. Hang on a second. Uh, um, yeah. Right. Running the wires. The control wires for the air conditioning which is going in. Uh, we're just checking it. We're putting the There's a control panel. Control yeah. panel. Control panel. Uh, leftover floor is going to be trimmed out. Let's go here. Yep. yep. Uh, now, alley. Alley angles to go there. Look at that. Pretty made for it, mate. Alright. Yep. So that's going to go there and just neat, n nice and neat. Make it nice and neat. It'll finish up on the on the floor there. Some skirting is going to go around. Yep. Right. Um, What's this thing here? What's this? Uh, that's the extraction unit. Ah, the air extraction unit? Yes, for the, for the, uh, for the kettles that are going to go underneath. Alright, so this is between the nib walls? Yeah, between the nib walls. Yeah, right, eh? Yeah, what, what about this, uh, this, uh, this uh, box uh, here? That's the main power, power yeah, box. Main power hub. And uh, C bus control system for all the lights. And yeah, right. Everything. Got some power here. There's power here for the uh, grain mill that's going to sit right here. Yeah, right the bench on. finishes about there. Yeah. And like a little grain, the grain bin mill is going to go there. Kitchen there. I, don't know, I got rid of a few other bits and pieces, so there's their main water in, there's our drain out, dishwasher power, stir plate power, coffee machine power. Yeah, coffee machine. Well, I have noticed actually quite a few 
Breedtube is doing detailed reviews of their control panels. Yes, uh, well, we'll, uh, we'll do that too. New to homebrew Tom, uh, g'day mate. Uh, been watching your stuff. Uh, really like your your uh, control panel. This won't be yellow. No, no. It's uh, staying as is. It's going to say as is. We're not quite that brave. Um, uh, but we'll do a full rundown of the control panel when we get to that part. Uh, we'll do a full rundown of the brew system uh, when we get to that part. And we'll probably throw to a few brew sessions at my place in between time. Yep. Oh, uh, well, brew sessions. Brew sessions. It'll be a while yep. before any brewing beer here. Yes. Yeah, it'll still be a little ways off. We've, yeah. uh, we've come a fair way though in the last little bit, I have to say. Yeah. So the next step will be uh, the roof. Um, yes. So uh, we'll count this as being uh, video one, upload one on our channel. Next bit is we'll finish the roof off. And the light, um, lights will go in. The lights and the speakers will go in. Then the down lights will go in. And yeah, that might constitute the next video. Uh, then after the roof, we need to finish the cladding on the walls and in the brew area. And then the benches go in, the sink, washing machine. We've done a lot. This site was nothing. It's been built. Every single nail in it. And screw and, and screw and timber. Uh, we'll give some other rundowns uh, on some of the pieces, but most of the material has been secondhand, reused, resourced, resourced. Not much has been new. Some timber. Yeah, some um, timber. It's very nice. We've, uh, as you can probably see from the back, all this thing's been insulated to uh, an inch of its life. You can see in the camera shot. I don't think you can. This was last last weekend. Yes. Last weekend was the installation of the air repurposed air conditioner. Uh, we do need to put on some uh, frosting tint on the window because it is gets really hot out. Uh, sun coming through just bangs down. So yes, yeah, so we're north facing, which is yeah sun. I think we'll probably call it there. Uh, I'll chuck in some extra shots. Uh, the brew house from day one to day now. Cheers. Keep informed. Cheers.